Call me Ishigami. Ministry of Defense. External Affairs. A special agency within the Ministry. Think of us like you ninja. And? She will provide you with the details. Mizuki McLeod, Japan Air Self-Defense Force Special Security Unit. Flight Officer, First Class. Yesterday, an unknown group launched a terrorist attack in London. They've taken control of the area around the Prime Minister's residence. So why me? What do you need my help for? <laughs> oh no. We don't need your help. You need ours. Mizuki, show him the video. This was just sent to us by the government. Bring us real, Hayabusa. 
Hayabusa. Bring us Ryu Hayabusa. It's you they want. Ryu Hayabusa. Hayabusa, can you hear me? Yeah, go ahead. All civilians have been evacuated. Any armed soldiers down there are fair game. The hostages are in the Prime Minister's residence, right? Yes. I'll monitor the situation and guide you from the air. Be careful, Hayabusa. He just took it deep, folks. Welcome, everyone. Baldemar here with another game for you. Ninja Gaiden 3. Well, I hope you all are enjoying it so far. Was that not intense at the beginning? That was freaking crazy. Oh, wait. I'm playing an M-Ray game now. I can say all the naughty words this time, unlike in Bray, which, interesting enough folks, I actually don't curse that much in real life, only when I'm really, really angry, but if a word or two slips out during this uh, game, you know, uh, I won't feel sorry for anyone. So, just to in it, folks, this game is rated in for blood, gore, intense violence, strong language, and suggestive themes. Oh, I haven't seen that yet. Oh wait, no, we did kill that big, big giant like uh boob lady or whatever it was earlier. So there you go. We, we covered all of them in the first like five minutes of the game. <laughs> now, if anyone has already checked a bit of this game out, this is car of a classic series that is known to be really, really hard. However. 3 doesn't seem to be like that. However, this is just the intro, and the intro, even to the original games, is kind of easy. You know, this is just the tutorial! Oh god. But, from what I've been hearing online, this game got really poor, poor reviews. Like, seriously, like a 3 is the lowest I've seen. From like, I, I think it was like IDN or something like that. So I'm kind of afraid that this game may not be as great as it is. However, sometimes critics don't know what they're talking about, right? Just play the game, see if you enjoy it, and that's what I'm here for. So for you who haven't played it yet, I'm here to enjoy it for you. Alright, you know what? Sword's pretty cool and all. Kills enough dudes. It's time to swap it out. Hey, you can't. I'm talking to the people here. You can't rock me in the face. How dare you? Okay, there we go. Change places! I mean weapons! <laughs> Holy crap, like this big ass size? You can tell that you can tell that's anime is right there. The main character just has a big ass weapon. Alright, looks like this is the slow, strong weapon. So if you want to do a lot of damage, there you go. But I think you watching you can tell that. Alright. Most of the games where big, these big weapons take a couple of turns time to kill a dude. And then you take forever. That's more of a no, it's nothing really specific. Alright, so, if that's the big heavy one, and the sword seems about medium. Claws, that's pretty cool, but. Are those all. Do you see those claws on his feet? He's got claw shoes. Really, game? Really? Our favorite ninja is wearing claw shoes? Please, let me live. Not me, mate. Not me. You just talked in a British accent. I should have never taken this job. I don't like British accents, especially when they're done poorly. I got a family, mate. Come on. You, you gotta understand. Your family know you knew? Your family knew you spoke with a British accent? How dare you? Listen, I'm just trying to feed my kid. Please, don't come any closer. I'm doing him a favor. Get up! Take it, bitch! You... <coughs> You're not human. He's a freaking ninja. That's not really Prime human, Minister's don't you residence think? Is straight ahead. Then again, real-life ninjas weren't like that. Well, maybe. I don't know. I don't Wait, know about real ninjas. Something's there. Uh-oh. 
And what a ninja movie would be about with a big ass giant robot. And it's a spider. A big robot spider. Let's fight it. Oh god! Oh god! Run! Run, 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 run! Run, run, run! But I'm Hayabusa! I shouldn't be having to run! I'm too awesome! There's an alley nearby. Hurry! Slide! Sliders! Looks like you got rid of it. We can't do anything with that thing around. This is no normal coup d'etat. Hey, when did you start speaking French? Dead end. You have to find another route. Where did I go, woman? Oh. Fine. Huh. Okay then. So, okay, press them down. Left, right, left, right, what? The heck? Did, was I doing that wrong? Left, left. Okay. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left. No, no, what are you doing? What are you doing? Shit, there he is. I already threw my dagger. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Okay. Nice work, Ninja. Wow, I almost failed at that. Well, at least he's like a real ninja, Ryu. Unlike other ninjas I've seen anime. Naruto. Bright orange. Oh, man. No sign of target yet. I'm gonna sneak up on you, bitch. Roger that. Keep looking. And gotcha. Got we falling with style. You can dodge missiles in midair. What the fuck? Sorry, it's hard to take you seriously with claws on your feet. Seriously, dude. Not sure what to say, buddy. Oh, what? No. I'm. Attacking in weird directions. Yeah, yeah. Ah. <laughs> this and God of War have got to have some of the craziest, like, just over the top. Let's just sort for a bit. Get some medium bits in there. There we go. Crazy over the top action. Although that game was fine, all the repetition, so. Man. This is probably the easiest it's gonna get. After that, it's probably gonna get really hard. Because, well, Ninja Guy games are always been like that. Spells? Do I get to shoot a fireball? Or. Give me a No, Ryu. That was not excessive at all. Dang. <laughs> Alright. Now I know I can throw big old pagans out of my face. Or how my hands. Oh, you uh, surrendered, huh? Too bad. I played Skyrim. I know what happens when you surrender to your opponents. They attack you anyway. So I'm not going to let it go in this game. No, sir. Reed. Man, I didn't know to go straight forward in this linear game. Well, that's probably only the tutorial. I shouldn't mock it too much. Slide! Oh no! A truck will stop me from jumping over it. I just have like the weirdest way to trap you in this situation of fighting monsters like Dante. At least in that Delmay Spy is like a big wall of souls or something. Not that it makes sense, mind you. It's just there. So, I hope everyone's enjoying the game so far. Um, it's nice to do something a little bit more super mature and action packed from Brave, which I am almost done by the way. Anyway. So it turns out a little bit different, a little bit more action packed. Probably be just as long as that, about five to five to ten hours, but I could be wrong. The thing I'm afraid of is not enjoying it, but because of the bad range, but I'll get a chance. Ah, yeah. oh, sorry for the sneeze there. Woo! Yeah! God, more than trees. You guys just come out of the woodwork. You know, if I saw my buddy get chopped in half with this crazy ninja who takes stabs to the face and rocket launchers to the face, 
I would probably quit my job. Maybe do something normal like be a dentist. You know. I can have relatives that are dentists. It's pretty sadistic. I think that's why they're dentists. That does pay a lot. Don't even try to shoot me, man. I'm a, I'm a freaking dentist. I'm a real high boost, but... Okay, let's try some stomp. What the heck did I just do? Did I just do a move without even knowing about it? Has the game not told me to do it yet? Alright, what's the... Ulti... What? I did the ultimate technique at the beginning of the game? Well, I don't need to play this game anymore. I'm after that, man. I don't like on games where bad guys just start pulling out heavy artillery like RPGs. I mean, in normal settings, people don't pull out projectile weapons of that sort. Alright. Definitely not the most gruesome in terms of blood, but it looks like. Definitely bloody, though. Does that make for a great game? Maybe not. It makes it fun, though. Wee! Wee! Oh. Alright, I keep forgetting that I have magic. Fireball! Now when I do that, I keep thinking of Tiger Ball Z song. Dragon, dragon, oh the dragon, oh, come and get me! Dragon, dragon, not the dragon, oh, come and stop me! I probably said that completely wrong. Yo guys, huh? Just a simple strong attack kills him. That's what I say anyway. Well, not kills him, but not the shield out of him. Ultimate attack! Split, side splitter. Actually, that would be kind of fun to have a, a game that gives two PvE teams or do different kills. Kind of like, uh, I think it's called Bulletstorm does that too. That was a fun game, actually. That had... Now, if you want a game with the most interesting, like, descriptive curse words and probably gaming history, go check out Bulletstorm in the story. It's, it's freaking hilarious. Alright, let's, uh... Let's switch the claws this time. Let's look like a waddling duck. Let me attack you. Quit, quit being, quit fighting. Ah, okay, I'm almost dead. Wow, that's pretty pathetic, Baldemar. Oh come on! Do I do I have to block to uh, to finish this tutorial? Oh god, I'm dying. Side split. Uh. Seriously. Good. As it should be. You save with a bird? I've seen weirder games. If you think that's if you think that's weird, you should play no more heroes. You save with a toilet. I'm not kidding. Okay. Well, with the bird saved and missile oh, oh god. And missiles coming my way. I think it's a good time to stop, folks. Oh I this is Valdemar, coming from you from Missile Central. I hope you enjoyed the enjoyed the episode. If you liked the episode, like it. If you want to see more of what I do, subscribe. I know this is the first time I've ever said that, but apparently if you don't say it, people don't actually do it. So, enjoy, folks. S see you later. Oh, God, here it comes.